We've reached the end. What is inside? Is it going to be another blob puzzle? <laughs> Before we actually get in. Or are we just getting straight in? We're getting straight in. Hello. Hello, the stone tablets. Hello, the stone tablets. Indeed. Eagle agrees. What language are these written in? Can you read them, Len? It's the code of the Leonar Order. I can read it, but I don't remember learning these letters. It's probably the knowledge from your echo. So, this is the true history? Well, it's none of my business, but after travelling so far, I'm a bit curious. What does it say? Long ago, evil raged across the land. Where it came from, or what it was, no one knew. Some say it arose from the evil hearts of men. The world went up in flames, and a group led by the hero, Leonar, tried to save it. But every attempt failed. The Harbinger was invincible. However, they found a way to banish him. Among the followers were the Vayan, a race of unimaginable magical potential. They had developed a spell with which they could imprison the Harbinger. The seal, however, would not last forever. To watch over the seal and the world, the Vayan moved to another dimension, where they gained immortality. The rest of the followers around Leonar took on the task of finding a weapon against the Harbinger. They knew that it was a quest that would take thousands of years. Therefore, it was their duty to make sure their mission and the knowledge about the Harbinger would never be lost. They created organizations, established a faith, built sanctuaries around Eldrea. And they even found a way to send a person's soul safely through the maelstrom in one piece. Ah! Slow down, Len. Your echo is responding to all this information. I am alright, thank you. Why did they go through all this trouble? People tend to forget. Organizations dissolve. Kingdoms fall. Traditions change. Over time, much knowledge is lost. That's why we of the Order of Leonar tried to spread all of the information as broadly as possible. We even drew on the faith of the people and founded the church. Are you kidding? The church was founded by the heroes of Leonar? You are pulling my leg. This evil, the Harbinger, is at the center of their faith after all and the church is eagerly awaiting their messiah, the Holy Mother. The Maiden of Leonor. In other words, Len here. If all this is true, was my soul transported on purpose? What is it that I have to do? As written on the stone tablets, we must find a weapon that can destroy the Harbinger once his seal is broken. A weapon powerful enough, powerful enough to kill such a being? Do you mean the Grand Grimoire? What the fuck was that? Oh boy, what is going on here? <laughs> yeah, you and me both, Sienna. What's happening here? This doesn't seem good at all. Pure miasma. Watch out, Chris. What the fuck? We're in the Windows background. <laughs> the Windows desktop background. Where are we? Uh, hi? Welcome, Maiden of the Order. Much time has passed since the last of your kind paid her respects to us and asked for our help. Who are you? Well, child, your echo seems to have not yet fully awakened, so let me introduce us. We are the Vayan. Ha! Huh. They're the fuck it like we s the Vayan. We saw the Vayan before. But they were, like, fucking massive and, like, alien fucking looking, and... Hmm. Saviors of this world. Conquerors of the Harbinger. You were the people that sealed the Harbinger? Sealing him, we did. If it had been in our power to kill him, we would have done so. However, thousands of years ago, no weapon existed that could harm him. Since then, we have been waiting here watching over Eldrea until a weapon is found. A weapon? 
Like this stone, perhaps? The grimoire that was stolen from us. So, you possess it now. What a twist of fate. The grimoire that was stolen from us. We know that the grimoire was stolen by Gwen, right? I'm pretty sure. So when... Because when the nuke went off, end of Act 1, the nuke went off. And we got that scene of uh, Gwen and June looking up at the sky as the eyes opened in the sky. And fucking... He was talking about the gods and how the gods were angry that their weapon had been stolen from them. So when he was saying gods, he meant the Vayan, I guess? If they're saying it was stolen from us, then I assume, was it their eyes that were looking down? And it's them that he stole from? I don't know how he managed that, especially if they're in another dimension. But, yeah, interesting, okay. But you may keep it, maiden, for it is of no worth to us. Can we use it to defeat the Harbinger? With this toy? No, this stone. What is this scent? It's Gwen. I smell it. He is close. Is that smell sticking to you? To me? It is you, thief! You have stolen the stone. How dare you insult us? What the fuck? What the motherfuck? Is this their true form? It is up to us to decide who uses the stone or not. The Vayan are judges and executioners. The Vayan do not forget. They do not forgive. Destroy. The boy. Destroy. What the fuck is occurring? We're back. What is going on here? Okay, Gwen actually saved our life, I think, is what just happened there. Someone just cut off our link to the Vayan. Okay, so... They think we're the thief. But we know Gwen's the thief. So are we somehow, like, has Gwen fucking split his soul or something? It has to be, right? That has to be why he can fucking telepathically communicate with us. Because we are, like, kind of the same person. That has to be it. Because we know he's the thief, but they think we're the thief. So the, that only makes sense if we are the same soul. And given that we know souls, like, can be passed down, we've never seen someone alive, like, two versions of one person alive at the same time. But I'm going to assume that that's probably possible to, like, if you can pass a soul down through generations, you can probably also split a soul in half and have two people with that soul. Or something like that. Something along those lines. Hmm. But then why did the Vayan help us at the end of Act 2? Well, I guess that was because Len needed to survive. They weren't helping us. They were helping Len. Interesting. 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 I re Man, this story is... There's so many layers to it, and there's so much you can try and figure out. Gwen? No. It's a different aura. Oh? I don't know who else but Gwen could be that powerful. Do you feel their hatred? Who's talking? It sounds different than the Vayne. Vayan? The people who once helped your order and banished the evil sit on the immortal throne, their power having gone to their heads. What do they care about the Grand Grimoire when they have countless weapons capable of the same destruction in their possession? They only care about their ego. Who are you? Follow the path and find the truth. I'm awaiting you ahead. Okay. This is fine. <laughs> I'm just, just going to leave. I'm just going home. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious me. What in the motherfuck? Ah, I fucking knew. I fucking knew this was a thing. Cool. Okay. Okay. Uh, well... Yeah, the Vayan are very scary. <laughs> the Vayan are very, very scary. 
Oh my god, okay. This what this is huge. Fuck me. Fuck me. Okay, so we need to get we can't use our sky armor here. We need to get blue down as well as red and yellow down. Hi. Oh, you're here. What a coincidence. <laughs> yeah, you've seen through me. I'm following you. Yeah. Okay, that's equal, that's equal, that's equal, that's equal, that's equal, that's equal. Uh, that would be a D grade. Get rid of you. Get rid of... Wait, no. This is, this is sick. Right, yeah. Metal shaped around the hand for hand-to-hand -hand combat. We still don't know how we find someone who uses this, but when we do, they can go straight to a rank 8, which I guess is going to be good. Uh, Dragon Mail is old now. Strong Suit is old now. Leather Gear is old now. Phantom Cloak is old now. Uh, all this loot. Is there anything we haven't read yet? Uh, a large chunk of ivory and worth a lot of money. Hunting animals for ivory is forbidden in most countries, but hunting monsters is totally fine. Get up to 91k. I am... New deals have been unlocked. I am wary that I need to get 100k. Uh, 100k to... Um, spawn that spawn that uh, unique monster. So I don't want to spend too much, but we have... Oh god. I say I don't want to spend too much. And of course, at that exact moment, fucking every single fucking thing completes. Are you joking me? You've got to be shitting me. You have to be shitting me. This would be 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18,000. That is so unfortunate that that happens at the exact same time. Hmm. Okay, well this is Anchor 8. I don't care about him. I'm not giving him his Anchor right now. Claws 8? We don't have anyone who uses Claws, so I don't need that right now either. This accessory makes every steal a success. So this is just an accessory you can give to her if you haven't already. But like, every steal is a success. We've got a 100% chance, right? So, I'm going to go ahead and say I don't need to buy that one. Leaf Hood allows Rob to use Trap Master. I have no idea what that means. I guess I'm curious enough to find out. Uh, Leaf Hood, and then I guess we should get the armor. Turtle-shaped potato from the all-grain grottos. Hmm. Okay. So we got three things, but we also left three things. So we saved nine grand, because we don't need an anchor right now. We don't need claws, and we don't need a stealing thing. All right. Rob. Uh, what have you got again? You've just got, like, a very basic attack up thing. So what is the leaf hood? 20% chance that Rob's trap stays after being triggered. No, that's shit. I think I didn't, didn't I even get rid of Rob? I don't think Rob even fucking uses that anymore. <laughs> so, fuck that. Okay, decorated vest. Does anyone else uh, want a decorated vest other than her? It is better for Rob, but I imagine Golden Brigandine... Like, if I put you in that, and then I go up to Decorated Vest, that's a negative. Yeah, okay. Bathraz, you want the Leyline Coat. Sienna's already in her best shit. You're already in your best shit. Wait, Glenn, you want Parade Armor, right? Yeah. Rob, you want... Oh, you just got that, yeah. Uh, Eagle, you can stay on the Golden Breastplate, mate. Uh, Len, you are good. Uh, you're already in the leyline coat, and you can suck my dick. I guess you could have a decorated vest. 
But also, I would never, like, bring you out. <laughs> like, the only time I bring you out is to eat something and then never use you, so... But I guess at least we could then sell the gemstone jerkin. So sure, I suppose. <laughs> Boop, boop, boop. Uh, right. Goodbye. 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 Three thousand eight hundred. Okay, I'm fourteen k off the hundred. Fourteen <laughs> k off the hundred. I really want to get it. I really want to get it. So I guess we're just going to be playing follow the leader for a bit here. It's... Hang on. Okay, wait. Before I do this, let's go... Let's just... Let's go this way and see what there is to see. Ah. So I guess I would have had to have come this way. I'd have, If I'd have kept going that way, I think I'd have just dead-ended there. How's it going? Boo -boo. Nice miss, bruh. Are they all weak to water? They are all weak to water. We are about to take all four of them in a row, so I'm going to do that. Yeah, that was a good idea. <laughs> You know what, I could probably finish them with a power swing, right? Nope. <laughs> Wrong. But we're fine. Oh, you're still alive? We can change that. How did that one have so much more health than the rest? <laughs> Haven't I been hitting them all pretty equally? Maybe not. I don't know. Uh, okay, so we are blocked off from going to there. We're blocked off from going to there. What's in here? Well, just a chest. Lovely. So this was a mandatory fight. Uh, what's in here? What the fuck? What is this vision? The entire world is on fire. Is this the work of the Harbinger? You would think so, but in reality it happened millennia, it happened millennia later. While these fires destroyed half of the world, the Harbinger was already sleeping inside his cell. What you see here is the result of the lust for power of the Vayan. But they were our allies. They banished the Harbinger. Okay, curious, curious. What does that button do? Unsure. Oh no, it's just one of the three buttons that I need to press to open the path, right? 
Okay, so that loops around. Okay, so this is the other side of this. Okay. So now I can hit this. Which means I can go up and hit this. Which means I can... Was there something else around here? Right, which means I can hit this. Which means I can hit... Wait, no, we just looped around again, haven't we? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> God. Complicated. Fuck, we need red to be down. Unless we can go left up here, we can't. Can I, is there a red that I can click around here without fucking myself? Oh, no, I can go this way now, right. Okay, so that one's up. Now I can go this way. <laughs> oh, this is so much. Howdy. Uh, enjoy. The sweet taste of blade reflection. Dread it. Run from it. Blade reflection arrives all the same. Well, she's dead. <laughs> That's fine. Worked out. You know what? I realized as soon as that ended that I should have just swapped her to Len and been getting the fucking weakness with all the water things, but I didn't. <laughs> I super only thought of that right after it stopped mattering. Why is there a birdie up there? Hello? You found a bird. Okay, what? What does that help me with? Is the bird coming back to the fucking base? <laughs> I feel like that has... There's got to be a reason for that, right? I think? Maybe? I don't know. Hi. My birds have disappeared. I hope they're alright. Can you check on them? There are three of them and they should all be nearby. Ah, right. Well, there we go. I got one of them. Uh... I can't go through there, can I? No. The Unit 35 has a defect that cannot be fixed. They cannot remember their tasks. Why do we not get rid of them? We like them too much. We would miss them. I think this is what I'm supposed to answer. Okay, there's Birdie. Uh, lovely. You found a bird. I want my bird. Hi. Okay, that one looks kind of hard. Can't go down there. Well, fuck it. Here we go. Okay, so I should just have Len out for you guys, right? Uh, and then water jump. Oh, what am I doing? I should have played Reflection. I swapped to Len after I blade reflection. Well, I'm dumb. Totally forgot that. The fat heal all. Hey, 
It's possible that this is not the way. I think these guys are too strong to just do the attack all thing on. I'll do it with Len because she has a water all. So that's super good. Holy shit, that hurt. Don't go for her, you bitch. This is about to really hurt. <laughs> well, fuck. This has not gone well. Safe to say, this has not gone well. I can't even water strike, motherfucker. Piece of shit. Ah, uh, fuck. Okay, yeah, the attack all. I shouldn't even be attacking all with Len. I should focus up with Len. The golems are too big a threat to be doing weaker all damage on. I just gotta focus on reducing their numbers. And I should have blade reflections to begin with. That started us off on the wrong, wrong foot immediately, which is never good. Alright, uh... Let's focus on this guy first. Then I swap you out, and I water thrust. Nice, okay. That's unfortunate. But now we win. Not bad, not bad. So yeah, we definitely can't walk through there. What have you got to say? I've been rescued. Thank you very much. I have an important appointment at the inspection. Wait, <laughs> why did we rescue that guy? Was someone going to tell us to rescue that guy? I don't know why we just rescued that guy. But sure, I'm not going to feel bad about it. Now, we still haven't found the other bird. I'm assuming maybe it's over here or something. I've heard you helped Unit 65 get here. Thank you very much. Oh. So that if I'd have just gone a bit further left there, then that would have told me. <laughs> the Sea of Flames again. The Vayan were indeed once your allies. But when the self-absorbed Vayan retreated to another dimension and gained immortality, their power went to their heads. Once, like the heroes of Leonar, they wanted to find a weapon that could defeat the Harbinger. But now they only think of how they can keep their own godlike status. They fear humans might become too powerful. Uh, 
Are the Vayan the real threat then? <laughs> Hello, I see that secret. Yes, got it. Nice. You're welcome, bro. So there they are. Thank you so much. I will go and look after them. Hi. <laughs> um, was there anything else down here? Or was that it? We can go there. We haven't been up here, have we? What was my task today? I seem to have forgotten. <laughs> ah, lovely. There's still four chests. That's a lot of chests. I feel like we must have missed one or something. I can't imagine there's still four ahead of us. Could there be? I mean, maybe? Mayhaps? We went down here, didn't we? Uh, hmm, maybe? Well, let's find out. Oh, this is just the end? Quite a doomsday atmosphere. All the voices you have seen so far are all from other events. Oh, did I say voices? All the images you have seen so far are all from other events hundreds of years apart. In order for the humans not to become too powerful, the Vayan created a weapon. With this weapon, they led the world to the edge of the apocalypse over and over again. Wait, so each of the three fucking, like, flamey things that we've been shown, they're each hundreds of years apart, and they keep, like, resetting humanity? But in their arrogance, they never used the weapon themselves. And so they left it with the humans, who managed to annihilate most of their own kind within only a century, all by themselves, over and over again. This weapon. This weapon was the Grand Grimoire. But this time, they did not give the weapon away willingly. A man, the one you call Gwain, stole it. Gwain stole the Grand Grimoire from these gods? Are you serious? Yeah, I mean, we knew that. But the question is, why did they scream thief at Glen? Is it because he is somehow part Gwain? Is his soul... They, do they share a soul? It's the only thing I can think of. That would explain their uh, anger at him. Uh, nope, that was that. God damn it. Was it the other way? It was the other way. That's crazy. That's like, that's massive fucking new information right there. If that is true. Wait, I'm still missing four chests. Like, how... How the fuck? Didn't mean to go back out. How am I missing four chests? Because, like, if I walk up there, that leaves the area, right? So, somehow, I'm missing four chests that I have access to. Have I, how could I possibly... Okay, well, there's two. Okay, so I need yellow to be down to get to there. Where's a yellow changer? Is a yellow changer down here? Yes, but I need blue change to do it. <laughs> oh, fuck me. But if I change... Mm, but then I'm not going to be able to get in there. I have to do that. And then I have to do that. But then I can't get through there. And then I won't be able to get where I want to. Unless... Aha! I can do that. There we go. Ambrosia Rune Blade, you say? Oh boy. Wait, it's only it's only plus one attack. The level nine weapon is only plus one compared to the plus version of the previous one. Like, wasn't... I'm pretty sure the last upgrade from, like, seven to eight, I'm pretty sure even with the plus version, it was still, like, a ten improvement. And then this time, it's only a one improvement. But sure, I will take it. 
What was the other thing I got? I immediately forgot what it was that we got from the other thing. I don't think it was any armor or weapon, was it? It was just a little thing. It was probably something like that. And Beelit's bow. And again, it's just a plus one. Sure. Cool. Okay. No, nothing left to grab. Good. Son of a bitch. Okay, I guess let's just make it easy on myself and do what I did, but in reverse. Rather than try and figure out some other shit. And now I can go back around this way. <laughs> I was going to try and figure out how to get through the top, but you know what? It's unnecessary. Let's just do this. Let's just do this. All right. Answers. Gimme. Oh, boy. <laughs> oh, good. Okay. Well, fuck. Well, fuck. screwed, aren't you? That can go there, and then that's fucked. Okay, that ain't the answer. Hitting you up puts you in a lose position. Hitting you left puts you in a lose position. Okay, if I hit you there, and then hit you left, that puts you in a win position. Because I can now hit you up, right, up, left, and land you here. But then, what do I do about you? Okay, let's just figure this out first. Oh, that's what I do about you. Okay, okay, I see. I do this. And then I do this. And then I do that. And then I do that and that. And then I do this and in. And shit, I've just realized, fuck, that doesn't work. Oh, you're so close. You're so close, but I can't get you in from there. No. Okay, there, that, that's almost it, though. That's like, I'm on the verge of having it. I'm on the verge of having it. So if I get something... Hmm. Hmm. Something gets stuck here. How then? Wait, which one was it stuck on? Okay, so that goes there. That would go there. That goes up, right, up, in. That one goes... No, that one... Yeah, that one goes up there. It goes there. It blocks this coming up. So you're here, and then I get you along there. But then this one is still in the way. And then I don't know how I'd get past that point. Hmm. I feel like I'm really close. That's it. Oh, no, it's not. God damn it. I, this is one over. Fuck. No. Oh, God. It absolutely starts with one of these getting fucking blocked by the other one here. That is 100% how that starts. And that seems like it makes sense. Oh! I just did it the other way round. I just do that, and then I do that. 
I was so close the like very early on I almost had it like immediately there we go man I was so close to having that like really early just one change in order and I almost accidentally did it I could have so easily just accidentally done it the other way right um does this does this seem like uh, the point to end off for you guys I know we're about to get some big fucking reveals or maybe a big boss fight or maybe I don't know I feel like some shit is about to go down uh and we've already kind of had a part's length, so... Uh, my apologies, but I'm pretty sure, yeah, I'm pretty sure through this door some, some shit's about to be uncovered, or learned, or whatever. We're, we're about to find out some stuff, so we will do that in the next part, I think. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. If you have, if you could leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. Share the videos around, share the playlist around if you can, I would really appreciate that. And I will see you next time for more Chain Decos. Thanks for watching. See you then.